Galia Granger joins me now along with Kirsty Cairns, who attended the, the boot camp, I guess we, we could call it. Now, look, Galia, I know it's a TV show and I know it has to be a bit extreme, but 450 calories a day, is that not dangerous? Uh, no, for a short period of time, which how, is its kickstart. How long are, are, do you put people on 450 calories? Um, it was between five and, in this case, seven days. Right, okay. And it's only seven days of their life right. practicing low calories freshly prepared fruit and vegetables. Yeah, because you couldn't sustain that. It would be impossible uh, to sustain that, wouldn't it? Absolutely. It will be detrimental if you sustain that type of right. kickstart uh, longer than seven days. And you are really tough. I mean, you say it's tough love. Some people might say it's been a bit of a bully, but, mm. you, but you ha why is it so important for you to be like that? Is it the only way they'll do it? Um, well, in a way, I'm a businesswoman. People pay me money and I want to deliver the results by hook or by crook. Right. Also, having done that myself, I um, have a strong belief that it's possible and it's all about the willpower and actually taking control. There's more to the program than just detox, fitness and weight loss, which is enough on its own. Sure. But it's just empowering people. The detoxing from caffeine, from sugar, it was nothing like I've ever done before. I've tried dieting in the past. This is just totally different. Right. I always think these crash diets, you end up putting on more weight mm -hmm. than you yeah. actually <laughs> try to lose. But it's a, it's a way of just, try, try, it's a, a short, sharp shock. Is that what we're trying it's to do? It's a shock to the system. Yeah, yeah. And I'm pleased to say, Kirsty and I are still in talking terms. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I don't know why. Have you ever had anybody walking out on you? Uh, just saying, I can't do it, I'm not taking this anymore. Very, very rarely. Right. And it's uh, all about the willpower. And, it, and I guess they know, you, you know, all right, you might bark at them and shout at them, but essentially you're on their side. I want them to succeed because it's a good reflection on you. Um, well, people are committed. They're committed their time and money. Uh, I suppose they're ready at that stage for the change. Right. And they need to embrace it. Uh, most people realise um, that um, unless they do like a brutal sort of routine, they can't change their old habits. Mm. Um, and also, um, it's only a few days of their lives. Most people feel amazing energy and they're surprised as to how much they can do on so little. Mm. Okay, and it, obviously, you know, uh, low calories are healing and there's nothing wrong in practicing fresh food for a few days of their lives. Uh, so how then do you move from that? You're doing that for a week. Now, the thing about the people that you work with, they're going to have your expertise. And when they go back to sort of eating well, properly, not going back to the, the fast food and the junk food and all the rest of it, but they've got you. The thing is, anybody maybe watching the show would think to themselves, so oh, I'm going to try and do that. They can't really do it on their own, can they? Um, it is best to do it under the supervision uh, of professional and yeah. qualified Otherwise, people. Otherwise, you make yourself ill. Where we control the sugar level. When it drops, we provide them with um, something, you know, natural to, to uh, stabilise the sugar level in a natural way. And we monitor them constantly. Right. Also, we do give them professional advice, nutritional advice, as to what is a sustainable diet afterwards. Mm. Right, so uh, you're nodding. So you got all of this it. information. Yeah, yeah, but what I, about, because yeah. a lot of us that are overweight, and I've struggled with my weight for years. I mean, I only got it back because doing my exercise yeah. classes, that's the way it worked for me. Um, and, 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 I, and it works for different ways for different people. Um, but it's how you sustain that, isn't it? And it's exactly. also sometimes it's not just about, it's what's going on in your head. Exactly. It's your relationship yeah. with food. So yeah. does that get addressed? That's it. Is that really oh, important? During the show, if you, if you watch the show tonight, there was this switch that, you know, Galia helped me switch on. And I just thought, do you know what? This is it. This is what I've been looking for. You had that light bulb over your head? Yeah, it was, <laughs> I had like the lowest of lows and I was ready to walk. I was ready to quit it. I was missing yeah. everybody. It was brutal. But then I had this light bulb moment right. in the middle of the show and I was like, do you know what? The, you know, you had this rush of energy and just, I just felt amazing. So do you feel a different person now? Oh, absolutely. I, I can see my... that you, you've lost a yeah, lot of weight, but yeah. will you keep that off? Um, hopefully, yeah. Don't I mean, say hopefully. Don't say hopefully. <laughs> <laughs> I know. So you trouble. Yeah, no, <laughs> no. Um, yeah, I intend to. We, yeah. we keep in touch all of the time, you yeah. know. That's um, very I'm, important. Yeah, that's... but I took a lot away with me. I'll eat vegetables now. I'll take, mm. you know, my little girl out for a walk with the pram and, you know, yeah. just everything. It's changed my life. And I know it sounds corny, yeah. but it did change my life going there. Well, the thing is, it's very easy, isn't it, just to, to have the pie. Oh, and too easy. Group, and everything's jumbo size yeah. now, isn't it? Yeah. It's, very, it's easy yeah. to do that. Too easy. easy. When you've got a little baby thing. as well. Yeah. And, yeah. The hard but, thing is actually to do what, what you have done. Yeah. So we're not saying, you've got, if you're going to do this, don't yeah. do it on your own. You've got to have no, no. proper help. No. E exactly. And also, um, 
there's an element of sustainability because we are chewing the food. You know, everyone accepts juice fasting nowadays. Yeah, yeah. But what we're doing is actually more sustainable because we're chewing the food at the retreat. And once people are, what we say, released out of captivity, <laughs> so they obviously continue chewing the food. And right. that is the way forward. Um, Hilary's here. Hilary, what do you think of that? Just a short, <laughs> sharp shock. Oh, oh Galia's accent alone would do it for me. Um, uh, no, I, I think it's really interesting. I've been listening to that. I think the problem is that what some people, a small proportion of people, would respond permanently to that short shock, uh, shock therapy. I think for the majority of people, they'd feel that they needed comfort and they'd feel hunger and tiredness afterwards in the second or third week. And that could be the start of yo-yo dieting, which nobody wants. It doesn't do anybody any good. So it's got to be sustainable. It's got to be something that can be maintained, that weight loss. And for the majority of people, this doesn't work long term. But it's interesting. It would work for me. No, it's fascinating. Fascinating. Uh, Thank you. It, it certainly worked for me. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> you did, you... Ten years of my life, I keep the weight off. That's the important I, I'm thing. I'm definitely no. re-energised. And it transformed the lives of thousands of my graduates too. Thank you very much indeed.